yes uh, to begin with this is the home screen of the zoom app what are we trying to do here we trying to show how a zoom meeting recording on the cloud can directly go and sit in the club youtube channel whichever you configured for your club meetings without you personally or manually upload i mean downloading and uploading it so you don't have to download uh, the recordings from the zoom cloud and then upload it to youtube anymore however big the size is of course i mean definitely takes time but you don't have to any do anything manually it is all taken care of through the configuration that i'm going to show you all in this video so let's begin with the chat icon here you see the apps over here i'm going to go into the add an app icon and click on it it opens the zoom marketplace i have categories over here as you can see and i have works with which element or feature of the zoom meetings i don't need zoom chat so i'm just going to click it off it gets refreshed i go back and click on zoom meetings and recordings so all the apps which are related to zoom recordings which can be seamlessly um, saved on to any of the different servers is given over here but as you all know we are very very acquainted well acquainted with youtube and would want to use only that i'm going to click on youtube for zoom now as you can see here i need to install this so for that i need to pre approve this this takes a few minutes so it's asking me allow all users on the account with the required permissions to install this app well yes because i am not the only one who's going to be using a hosting uh, using this account anybody who uses this account and hosts it from their desktop can easily uh, for i'm giving them the permission to install youtube for zoom on there so i'm installing it here now see i need to authorize okay this is very important step now authorize plain to access your youtube account yes so you can see here this is my youtube account and i'm allowing it okay your zoom account is now successfully linked to your youtube account so i'm just closing it you get immediately a mail saying that you've given an access is it you who's given an access those are all the security ones so now here in configuration you can see uh no i'm not going to show you our configuration now i'll just quickly go back to my zoom again go back to app the marketplace and zoom meetings and recordings okay here i'm going back there to zoom as you can see it's installed it's pre approved which means uh i've given it permission to view the recordings on the zoom cloud server manage the recordings and user information as well now here manage when i click um i can uninstall the app and i can also configure the youtube for zoom connections so what is it now this is connected this is connected these have to be connected okay i am giving it a different configuration here saying delete this recordings in zoom after it's uploaded to youtube which is fair enough otherwise your zoom cloud space is going to get occupied suppose if it's more than one club let's say three to four clubs using the same account and all of the recordings are going out to zoom cloud server then it's going to take a lot of space there so it's better to delete it once it's uploaded to your youtube channel upload only my webinar recordings otherwise even the chat and the audio whatever is there can also get uploaded so i'm just going to keep these two things yes there's one more which is recording private if you want to keep it as private but most of us want to keep it as public so i'm not taking this up here i'm going to close this here and now what i'm going to do is i'm going to start a zoom meeting before i take this further i'll just open up yeah this is open so okay i'm going to start a zoom meeting here go to home and say new meeting Okay, it's connecting now. In this uh, meeting, I'm going to just I'll start the recording to the cloud, 
and um, I'm going to share the screen and show I'm going to share a PowerPoint presentation on my Mac okay suppose I'm just doing this as a part of the meeting and then I stop the share and I also stop the recording and 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 I'm ending the meeting now okay once the meeting ends I'm going back to zoom home screen going to meetings and going to record it you can see that my meeting has not been uploaded the recording has not been uploaded yet here so I'll just refresh this until that happens which is going to take me some time I probably would have to edit this yeah it's here the recording so I'm just going to open the recording on the zoom cloud this is the recording on the zoom cloud now I'm going to go to my YouTube channel of of my club um, yeah. Yeah, this is my club thing here I'll just be going into your videos okay can you see here it's pending so it's directly come in here so all these videos that you're seeing here have been uploaded directly from the zoom cloud uh, server to the YouTube YouTube server well now it's ready as you can see here this is what I have done I'm just going to open this video you can change the, I mean, it's the the nearest is the regular editing that you need to do. So, new start uh, uh, Zoom to YouTube video, and then whatever description you have to give, th you know, the uh, thumbnails and so on and so forth. After I save it, I go to play this. So, you can see my YouTube video here. Right? So the Zoom recording directly from the server has been uploaded to the YouTube channel. Now what else can you ask for without me downloading or and uploading it once again. So it's all in here as simple as that. Close. Can you see this recording does not exist. Once it is uploaded in the YouTube channel here from your Zoom it uh, vanishes off kind of it's deleted because I configure it that way in the marketplace.